Chuck E. Cheese has gone bankrupt twice, but they're still around today. Check this out. In 1977, this dude Nolan Bushnell wants to start an arcade. Pause. Nolan Bushnell? Do you watch my clips? He's also the founder of Atari. Okay, so he realizes with Atari that all the arcade game money is made at the arcade. So he sets out to build his own. He decides he'll serve food with his games, but it has to be pizza because pizza takes a while to make. So people will spend more money on games while they wait. He also introduces animatronics because they're cheap and once they're set up, they're a reliable source of entertainment. He wants to call his new place Coyote Pizza. But when he opens the box for the Coyote's animatronics costume, it's a wrap. So Nolan settles on Chuck E. Cheese's Pizza Time Theater, a division of Atari. But here's their problem. Chuck E. Cheese had a competitor they were trying to beat to market. So Nolan scales Chuck E. Cheese as fast as he can. But he has no long-term data for how his stores operate. They open more stores and those stores do less sales. Today they profit $50 million per year and have a billion dollars in debt.